don't look at me like you're very fascinated like that. So after you've done the basic setup, I'll be attaching the line to a sweeper and then to this tamba hook that I got from the uncle at the Let's get started. Now I'll be doing a, a trilling knot to connect the main line to the sweeper. So I will put the main line through the eye of the sweeper once and then again twice. So when you go through the eye twice, you form a loop, right? The shorter line will go over the longer line a few times. Usually I'll go about three to four times. After that, this shorter line will go through the loop and you can just tighten it. Cut away the excess line. this to the tambang hook. So, how the tambang hook works, we open it, there is one end connected to a swivel already, the other end is a loop. So, this swivel is meant to be connected to the sinker and this hook is to be connected to the swivel that you just tied to your main line. So, you open the swivel. After this, you just entangle uh, the whole tongue. So after you are done, you connect the sweeper at the end of the tambang hook to a sinker. You open the sweeper. You usually use a light sinker for jetty fishing. Right, put the sinker in and close the sweeper. And your setup is done. So this is Bolo Jetty and these are the various catches that uh, you can find over here. Okay, so I'm going to teach you how to cast for Tanban. Uh, firstly, you hold the rod with your right hand. Use your index finger to hold the line. Make sure that the line is towards you. Open the bill with your left hand and then you can just... Uh, so you can close the bill. You don't have to go all the way down. Then you just reel in and jig. So you see you reel in all the way to you already. You just reel up and recast again. will look like they are moving underwater. Then you will look like a fake fish and uh, the tambans will bite. Delicious nasi lemak fish. The best time to fish for tambay uh, will be first light and last light, which is about 7 a.m. and 7 p.m., where the sun rises and sets. Yeah, so uh, you can fish at Bodo Jetty or Labrador Jetty. These are the two common places for tambay. Okay, so usually we'll fish against the water current. Okay, so if you look over here, uh, today the water is flowing in from this side, so we'll fish here instead of uh, the other side of the jetty. Yeah, so there's two sides. Today we'll fish on the left. Uh, you can just consume the tambay uh, by frying it 
Another uses of tamban that is my personal favorite is to use it as bait uh, to catch bigger fish at other locations. Sometimes <laughs> you can get self food as well. <laughs> you want to do it yourself? Okay, sure. <laughs> yeah. So be careful not to cook yourself. Unless you think that you are a big fish. <laughs> Tamban can be used for eating. Okay, okay. The best time to fish for tamban will be uh, first light and the last light, which is the last light.